So in this video, we're gonna talk about how to boost your pregnenolone for more hormone energy, okay? What is pregnenolone? It's a precursor or a main building block to make your sex hormones and your stress hormones, okay? So we're talking about DHEA, estrogen, progesterone, testosterone, other androgens, uh, and cortisol. This is made out of cholesterol. Now, you've probably watched my other videos when I talk about cholesterol, and the purpose of cholesterol is a hormone building block. Well, here we have it. So if you're on a statin drug, which basically blocks your ability to make cholesterol, guess what happens to the hormones? They all take a dive, okay? So we need cholesterol, very, very important. If we don't have this, enough of this, our memory suffers, we get tired, we get brain fog, we can't sleep, we lose our vitality, libido, and we, we fill up with inflammation, okay? Because cortisol is an anti-inflammatory. Now, sometimes when you go through stress, um, this hormone will hog a lot of this right here. So it won't leave enough for, for making these hormones. There's a term called pregnenolone steel where the adrenals are hogging this at the expense of um, these hormones right here. So stress is one reason why your body might not have enough of this. Also, the thyroid, if the thyroid is slow, um, that could be another reason why you're not able to make this as well, in which case you should watch my video down below and I cover what to do if you have a thyroid problem. So there's a couple points you wanna understand. You wanna make sure you have enough cholesterol. Are you eating enough eggs, high quality meat, butter? If not, you should probably start. Next one is keep your insulin low. All right, next one is lower your stress, okay? Because we want to help um, lower this right here. Now I have a really amazing video for that. It's called Stress Webinar. Uh, if you haven't watched that at some point, watch it in the next couple days. Uh, it can really help your stress level. Okay, next one is get enough sun because vitamin D can greatly lower cortisol, okay? Um, by the way, mushrooms do have vitamin D, especially mushrooms that are actually out in the sun, believe it or not. Um, okay, sea salt. When the adrenal glands are stressed and overwhelmed and fatigued, you can actually take a little more sea salt to recharge them. And lastly, um, you can actually even take this as a supplement, okay? It's very easy to get, it's not that expensive, and this could actually give you a nice boost, if, especially if you're going through menopause or premenopause, by the way. So I don't have any specific brand, you're just gonna have to go by reviews and then read the back of the label as far as the dosage. Um, but a lot of people take it with great success. And these are some other things that you can do as well. All right, well, thank you so much for watching. Hey, if you're liking this content, please subscribe now and I will actually keep you updated on future videos.